And now it's playtime. Hey everyone. Hey everyone. So today we are going on a trip. It was supposed to be a surprise, but Odin guessed where we we're going because I put him in this t-shirt. And Matney always does themes. Themes. Yeah, it makes sense of what you put me in. Yeah, I didn't realise I did that, but Odin guessed straight away. So we are going to a dinosaur event at Homeside Park. But after weeks of lovely sunny weather, it is now raining. And it's outside. So we're probably going to get wet and muddy, but we're still going to have a great time. And we are going to film so you can see what we do. Yeah, and we're in the car right now. Yep, we are, and we're just about to go. Yeah. Okay, so see you soon. Yeah, let's go. Did if you noticed, I'm in my flat seat, by the way. Starting route to home side park. Yeah. In the flat seat. Yeah, so let's go. It took us so long to get here, but we're here. If I was recording that long, you wouldn't get to be here because the battery would run out. Dinosaur. Do you know what it means? Fearsome lizard. Terrible reptile. Oh yeah. Dinosaurs started walking the earth 230 million years ago, but they weren't first creatures to exist before the earth was dominated by reptiles. Dinosaurs lived on earth till around 65 million years ago. The first dinosaur ever given a name was the Megalosaurus. The biggest dinosaur bone ever measured was 5 foot by 5 foot. What kind was it? It was the backbone of an Argentinosaurus. Oh, that's a big dino. Dino eggs? What kind of dinosaur eggs do you think they are? Carnivore eggs. Carnivore eggs. Baby dinosaurs! Gonna touch one? <gasps> There's nothing in it. <laughs> you went to jump. What dinosaurs in there? T Rex. T Rex. Okay. No, I think it's too way too small for a T Rex. This is like I should from you know, like the size of a goat. <laughs> That says it's a dino sutures. Big board you've got. What do you think it ate? That looks a bit like an Argentinosaurus. Pretty big. Do you know what the dinosaur just means? Terrible claw. Yeah. Come on. Well, there's a little den. A little den. Let me find a den. Nope. No. 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 No.
What is that? On a falafel. A what? On a falafel. See, that's Laura for me. Wait a minute. I'm gonna go. A Phyllis, Philosophodon. Now, so this egg is out. Are you keeping the music egg back? Or here? What's that one all done? That is a reptile. A reptile, so it's not a dinosaur. Be careful. See the biggest of them all? The Indominus Rex? I don't think the Indominus Rex, I think that's just, just on Jurassic that? World. There's a Brachiosaurus! Brachiosaurus! What are you doing, big buddy? That's a Brachiosaurus. Yeah. Wait, yeah, where's that bone on that herbivore? What? Where's that bone on that herbivore? Uh oh. I don't know. They said it's a Brachiosaurus. It's too small for a It's too small. Yeah, it's too small. And way too small for a daughter. Yeah, it is. Maybe it's just a baby one. It's too small to lay eggs. And it's too small to come out of one. Yeah, we can. <coughs> See your bum, Mama. It's mum. I think you should be over with a mama. You needed to be with its mum. Yeah. Is it happy now? Is it happy now that they're with the man? Yeah. Be careful. Look at that one hanging. So these are pterodons. Pterodons had no teeth. How did they not have no teeth? The flying reptiles. The creature's name translates to wings and no teeth. I didn't know they had no teeth. And had hollow wings. It, yeah, it says that. It says pterodon bones were hollow, making them lighter than most other creatures of their size, so they could fly at high speeds, making them aerodynamic. Yeah, <laughs> aerodynamic. <laughs> so bye bye. You're not as aerodynamic as me. Who? Not? You're not as I'm not as aerodynamic as you. How? Watch. Bye. Bye. Saltosaurus. It's a patasaurus. Saltosaurus. How is it a salt? What is a saltosaurus? I've never even heard of that before. You say those spikes? Yeah. That means salt. So is this baby patasaurus? That is still saltosaurus. I've never even heard of saltosaurus before. It's a cute saltosaurus though. A big egg. Mm -hmm. What is that? A Should bone when this is a herbivore? Just for decoration. Uh, Do you know what a patasaurus means? It, it's saltosaurus. Well, okay. Well, do you know what a patasaurus means even though this is a saltosaurus? Um, so, I'm going to tell you what a saltosaurus means. Saltosaurus means salted lizard. What is it? Salted lizard, does that mean it tastes nice? No, it just means the spice like salt. Okay, well, a patasaurus means deceptive lizard.
is that one? Protoceratops. Yes, that's right. Yeah. A proto. I protoceratops. And I have an umbrella. Yep, I just umbrella ring along. I'm just umbrella ring along. I'm just umbrella ring along. Protoceratops means first horned face. Yeah. It was one of the smallest species of dinosaur, yeah. being the size of a sheep. Lizard! Pardon? That's right, oh, I see close seven! What Stegosaurus means? You know what this means? Player? No. It means. We're gonna see carnivore next. Why? Because this means it's scared of the carnivore, this oh, colour. Because it pumps the blood to them? Yeah. I knew that, you already told me. Look, it's a skill. Owie! Owie! Oh. Oh, it's a big one. Oh, look at the eggs. They're cute. I think there's a troll under the bridge. What Are is you... it? There's a troll under the bridge. What did you say? Oh no, it's just Odin. What did you say? There's a troll under the bridge, but what? it was just you. You mean like the troll? Like the great door? Yep. <laughs> Did you actually think I was a troll? No, <laughs> I was just kidding. Hey. Hey. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Wanna come? Come down here, okay? It's a It's a troll under here. Is there a troll under? <laughs> no, there's not. There's a house. What? There's a house. Who do you think would live in that house? You would if all these dinosaurs were real, wouldn't you? Yeah. No. Yep, yeah, so we've gone in a circle and we're back at the Patasaurus. I mean the Brachiosaurus, which Odin thinks is a Patasaurus. Yes? Yeah. Oh. Did you know the first dinosaur to appear on screen in Jurassic Park was the Brachiosaurus? Echopathosaurus. But a Brachiosaurus was the first dinosaur to be shown on Jurassic Park. Was the Pathosaurus? No, it was the Brachiosaurus, but that might be. Oh. Some eggs there. What? Some eggs behind you. Oh. Yeah. What is it? It's a over. Go over. Wow, that is a triceratops, right? Do you want to head up to see the T Rex? T Rex? Come on So then if you're not scared. I'm not scared. Go closer then. Well, like you're gonna fight me. <laughs> <laughs> Why 
what if it does bite you? What are you going to do? Well, it can't bite me because those claws are too long for it. And it has too many fingers. Too many fingers? Two. Go on then, go closer. Mm -hmm. nice. Ah! <laughs> nice T Rex. Nice T Rex. Nice T Rex. Nice T Rex. Nice Here, listen to you. Oh, that's a big. You're big. You're big, Tina. I think it's scary. You're not scared for me. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you keep jumping then? Feels real. Not <gasps> Feels real, doesn't it? it doesn't. Yes, it does. It oh. real. Yes, it does. Real, it would be like very strong. It is very strong. now. Oh, it's not in. Say bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Pardon? Bye. 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 Yeah, it's about the T-Rex. Got to read it. Yeah. Well, we know what T-Rex me name means. Tyrant Lizard King. The average T Rex could tear through 220 pounds of flesh in a single bite. That's like more than me and you put together. One bite would both be gone. So the T Rex? Yeah. A T Rex. Yeah, but a T Rex skull alone was five feet long. So that's like the size of me, a little bit smaller than me, that's just its head. The T-Rex teeth were the size of bananas, the largest tooth of any carnivore dinosaur. Look at that Gigantosaurus! Well, yeah, that's what it says. Gigantosaurus isn't even big. It, a tooth was one foot long, including the root. When T-Rexes became teenagers, they would gain around 600 kilograms for a year for four years. That's 1,300 pounds. Yeah. Scientists believe T-Rex could run at speeds of 20 kilometers an hour. It's not the fastest dinosaur, but they'd still be able to catch most humans, yikes. The T-Rex was super smart too, boasting a brain twice as big as other giant carnivores. I don't think it can catch up to me. I think it can. What's that? What is it?
This one's a Mutaborosaurus. These are some more of my cool videos here on Odin's Playtime. To watch, just scroll down and click on my picture just like. Don't forget to hit the red button so you don't miss any new videos. See you next time.